Do you receive frequent notifications from Nagios because the host or service went down that you were previously aware of? If so, you can prevent this by scheduling a reoccurring downtime. From the web interface, under Incident Management, you can click on Reoccurring Downtime. And you can schedule reoccurring downtime based on the host or service, host groups, or service groups. For the purposes of this demo, we're going to select it by a host. Click on Add Schedule, then type in the host name. Then we're going to give it a comment of daily snapshots. And the time is in 24 hour format. We're going to say 1 in the morning for 10 minutes. And we're going to have it our reoccurring downtime scheduled for every day of the week, so we're not going to select a specific day. Same for valid days of the month. If you only want it to happen on a particular day of the month, you would put it here. Otherwise, the default is every day if it's left empty. After you have all your options selected, click on Submit, and your reoccurring scheduled downtime is now set up. One of the things to keep in mind with reoccurring downtime is you're going to get a notification every time the downtime starts. If you want to avoid this, you can click on Configure, go to My Account Settings, Notification Preferences, unselect the host downtime, and that will prevent the notifications every time the downtime starts. Click the Update Settings button, and you have now successfully scheduled recurring downtime.